Good morning. Day 396, is it? 97? It's hard to keep track. Uh, but today is another life lesson, and it's on stealing. Now, you can only imagine that uh, commitment number two is be kind to others. And that would be don't steal from others. That's kind of obvious. But uh, the other day at, um, oh, I'm going to call Hadaba Beach, below Hadaba, there's a beautiful beach there. Uh, someone stole someone's um, phone while they're in the water. And police came and it was a big deal and they interrogated people for two days. And you know, they have cameras everywhere. As you might remember, someone stole my wallet. Well, maybe I lost it, maybe I, uh, uh, they stole it. I think they stole it, but I don't cast blame on things. So it doesn't matter if I lost it or if they stole it, it's gone. Um, at any rate, so people do steal and that's breaking commitment number two. Now, uh, so my friend just came to my apartment early in the morning. He went for a swim and he knew not to take his wallet and his phone and valuables uh, to the beach. So he didn't. He did take his dog to the beach and they stole it. I mean, it's Ramadan, people. And uh, of all times, you shouldn't steal, but and this is the time where people are giving free food to the poor people, which is fantastic. And they steal his dog. And a couple hours later, his maid found an Egyptian with the dog and confronted him. And he ran and she got the dog back. So that's fantastic news. Two hours without your dog is a long time. I lost my dog once at a family um, party. And um, luckily I found it before the, the party started. But... I would have been in a lot of trouble uh, if I hadn't found that dog. It's a long story, but it was an amazing, lucky story because I'm a lucky, lucky guy. I wasn't lucky to lose the dog, but I was certainly lucky to get her back, or a family dog of 15 years. So stealing is really, really bad. Um, in some countries, they chop your hand off for stealing. It's a big deterrent. I think they should have some harsh deterrents for murder, for stealing, for being a bad person. So commitment number two in the Be Fantastic philosophy is be kind to others. Now, I've traveled around the world, and many times people have put me up, and inevitably, something goes missing. And, you know, you're the guilty party because you're the only stranger in the house, and it's a terrible feeling to be accused of stealing. And one of the things my foster father always taught me is never bite the hand that feeds you. That's the worst thing you can do in life. Someone's helping you, and you steal from them, it's horrible. So, uh, you know, I give a lot of life lessons, and they're just simple lessons. We're taught this as children to be kind to others, but for some reason, because of the money, we lose track of being kind and takes a back seat, and greed takes over. Don't steal. And uh, well, any other examples of stealing? <laughs> it's, it's just a bad thing all the way around, you know. Whoa. Sorry about that. Uh, so, day 396, I believe, or I think 397. Um, I'm going to go, I guess I'm going to get a Turkish massage and a whole treatment because my shoulder is still pretty bad and uh, I could use a, a nice day of the spa. So, at any rate, have a fantastic day. I um, hope you're enjoying the, fin uh, for you charmers, hope you're enjoying the, the fantastic signs around town. It's my pleasure to try to put a smile on everyone's face. Be fantastic, everyone. Enjoy the day. Enjoy the weekend. Have a fantastic weekend. It's coming up. Uh, even though they locked down Charm at 9 o'clock, it's kind of nice because I've been not wanting to go out and party and dance and get crazy. Um, and so 9 o'clock is, yeah, watch a little movie and uh, relax. So everyone, be fantastic. We'll, we'll get through the, we're going to get through the COVID thing. We're going to get, you know, life goes on. Um, what is it? Um, uh, time heals all wounds. But, um, oh, by the way, chip your dog, your animal. Uh, put a, a collar around them with your number, in case it was lost, the dog or animal. And your belongings, carve with a knife, carve your initials in your bicycle. Uh, and everything you can. Uh, take pictures of your uh, all your documents. So if someone steals your wallet, you have a picture of your driver's license, your, your credit card. So... You know, it's a bad, bad world. I'm trying to make it a better world, but sometimes you just have to be smart, protect your things, 
carve your initials and shit, you know? Someone, there's a lot of bikes that look the same, but if your initials carved in it, it's kind of tough to say, that's not my bike. And uh, be kind to others, everyone. That's today's lesson. Be kind to others. Have a fantastic weekend. Welcome to the Be Fantastic channel, where you will find many fantastic interviews with amazing people. Visit the top world museums, incredible zoos, beautiful national parks, special events and much more. These videos are designed to educate, inspire, motivate and entertain you. We hope you will enjoy them. Join the Be Fantastic philosophy. Please subscribe, like and share. Overpopulated cities around the world have caused people to become a greedy, selfish, and litigious society. Would you like to be happier, live longer, never be forgotten, and help make the world a kinder, more civil place? It's actually easier than you think. Every day you're asked, how are you? Instead of saying good, say, I am fantastic. It will make you look better, feel great, and reduce your stress. Making the world a better place starts with each person. Please join the Be Fantastic movement today. What you want to be, you can be. Be fantastic.